Len Ramirez takes a closer look at why some tech executives and investors are lining up behind Trump. Well, tech and venture capital millionaires hosting presidential candidates is something that happens almost every election year here in Silicon Valley. Usually, it's Democrat candidates being hosted by progressive-leaning supporters. But now, with former President Donald Trump coming to San Francisco, what was once practically unthinkable in 2016 and 2020 is now one of the big political stories of 2024. Former President Donald Trump is swinging through California this week, attending campaign fundraisers in some of the wealthiest enclaves in the Golden State. In San Francisco, tech entrepreneur David Sachs and venture capitalist Chamath Palihapitiya, who co-anchor the All In podcast, are co-hosting a reception and dinner at Sachs Mansion in Pacific Heights. It all comes just a week after Trump's criminal conviction on 34 counts and aims to tap Silicon Valley support for the former president. Well, I think it's pretty revolutionary because in prior elections. Armeet like Dillon is the former vice chairwoman of the California Republican Party and a Trump lawyer. Century now. And you never would have seen a tech leader come out and say they support uh, President Trump or, for that matter, most Republicans. It's been such a woke left-wing culture here. The fundraiser is charging $50,000 per ticket, and that's just to get in the door. It's $300,000 per person for the reception and dinner, and $500,000 per couple. It's expected to raise tens of millions for the Trump campaign. Earlier this year, President Biden and Vice President Harris were hosted by Bay Area tech leaders that raised millions for their campaign. Candidates go where the money is, and there's a lot of money in uh, the Bay Area. Silicon Valley, San Francisco. Um, he will be visiting other, other parts of the state as well. And even though California is a, a deep blue state in terms of you know, the statewide electorate, um, there are, again, some very wealthy individuals who will be donating to his campaign. San Jose State political science professor Melinda Jackson says most of the tech industry still leans left. I think a majority of uh, you know tech industry folks um, still support Democrats, and there are many wealthy uh, tech donors who will be contributing to Biden's campaign and other Democratic causes. Um, but, uh, you know, there are some conservatives among the bunch. But Trump supporters say the fundraiser is also symbolic of what they call changing times in Silicon Valley. What President Biden is doing to our country and what people are suffering here in the Bay Area is so extreme in terms of threats to business and opportunity, threats to quality of life and even safety that I think it is driving a lot of tech leaders to demand change uh, at the top. And that's why they've stepped forward and publicly are supporting President Trump with their dollars. And when it comes to Silicon Valley dollars, both campaigns will take the money and run, likely spending most of it in the handful of battleground states that will decide the 2024 election.